Hi kittens, welcome back to the Kitty Corner. Today I am I am back in Bloxburg like normal and I'm going to be doing a house tour of my new house. So basically I've done a couple videos with this house, but I haven't actually I'm still working on this house, but I've pretty much gotten a lot of it done. So I'm just walking in circles now, but um I thought I would give you a little tour today. So we're just going to start right out in the front, but First of all, give this video a big thumbs up if you want to see role plays in this house. All right, let's get started. So right over here, I have the, I think it's called the Route 600. I'm pretty sure. Let's check in build mode. Yeah, no, Route 500. Okay, the Route 500, and it's like pretty green. And um, then I have some trees. And just the classic mailbox and trash bag. And then over here I have a trash can and a recycling can. Then I have the automatic sensor on this garage door. I have the moped and the block side voyage. And I have a power box. Okay, anyway, I'm going to go back out here. And I have a nice big front yard. And then I can go in through the front door. And there's a table over here that has some books, a plant, some more books, and like a picture of some fireworks. Then there is a big picture that says, be a pineapple, stand tall, wear a crown, and be a sweet and be sweet on the inside. Then this one says, take me to the beach where there are things far larger than life. Picture of Frida Kahlo and like a weird picture of a girl's hand on her face. Then over here I have a laundry unit. Oh yes, pictures are back for me, you guys. Thank God. Hallelujah. Chat. I need to just check, check. There's a sign that says laundry rules. You wear it, you wash it. Check your pockets, separate lights and darks, finders keepers, treat stains before washing, wash, dry, fold, repeat, have loads of fun, today. laundry today or naked tomorrow. And then down there it says wash, dry, and fold, repeat. And then some cleaning equipment, some towels, some laundry detergent up there, some a laundry bin, and the laundry machines. Then over here I have the kitchen. I have a trash can. It's actually the complete round circle, like uh, cylinder one, but it just happened to be cut in half right by the counter. I have some stools over here. Nice kitchen. And a kitchen rule sign that says, Our kitchen rules help set and clear the table. Always be polite. Chew with your mouth closed. Good manners always. Eat your vegetables. Sit up straight. Give every food a try. No phones. Help the cook. Say please and thank you. And then I have the sink, the blender, some chocolate cupcakes, a stove, a kettle, microwave, coffee brew 3000, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called, ice cream machine, fridge, and some cabinets, and the microwave. Over here we have, I actually was going to make something here, but then I decided not to, so I need to scoot this table back over to the left, but there's a nice big table with a table runner, a placemat, and a nice little spiky plant with some modern chairs. And then I have a dresser over here with some colorful books that are going into the stairs, but that's okay. Um, on the other side of the stairs, I have the living room. I don't know why my screen is so foggy. I'm sorry if it's affecting the video quality, but whatever. Um, my living room. So I have the newer, I think this is a new couch actually. Not positive, but I have a couch over here, a smaller chair thing, and the table with the remote, and like a little table that I can bring food to. Like, if we're watching, like, a football game. I don't know why we would be on Bloxburg, but if we were, and then I can walk, bring our food over here so we can eat while we watch the game. And then I have a little stuffed octopus and some nice full shelves of randomness and a big bookshelf and a nice big TV. Oh, and a banner across the fireplace. Okay, we're going to head on upstairs now. I have right at the... When you get up the stairs, I have this nice little lounge area. You can sit here and read a book. My game's a bit laggy, I think, but here is the book. Um, then there's, like, this, like, little Pixar lamp looking. It's not exactly a pic the Pixar lamp. It's just that kind of style and a nice plant. And over here, I have a kid's room. I know this is kind of like just for girls. I mean, boys could like it too. I'm not saying that they couldn't. I'm just saying I know it's kind of themed for girls, but that's because I never really adopt boys. Um, and I'm not saying I wouldn't. It's just that I never really do. It's just like only girls that actually respond to when I, adopt, when I say ABC for a mom. 
So, yeah, and I just put it, these little uh, pictures that say, believe in myself, I'm so magical and a fury. And then the hanging lights, too, and those lights, too. Um, and then over here, there's another plant and some paint and a nice painting that, like, we can pretend they painted a little butterflies. Some more plants and a cabinet with some books, a trash can, and a carpet. And then in here, this is inspired off, it's a clique, a, a, it's a Kila. Go check her out, guys. She's amazing. The nice curtains and some rainbow lights all around. And then there's nice shelves and a little chair. Um, I forgot to show you something downstairs. Oh, over here, there's some, I pretend there's slime in the bed and the books and the cat stuffed animal. Um, I forgot to show you my office which used to be upstairs but now i moved it downstairs and there is some pictures it says there's no elevator to success you have to take the stairs live a colorful life the computer the phone the mug the papers and the pen jar and my office chair then it says it's okay to be boring the 14 day streak trophies some books and some more books stacked up on the bottom shelf of it okay going back upstairs over here, we just saw the kids' room, and then there is an adult's room, aka my room, a nice closet area, a nice double bed, some, some swirls, and a nice gray wall, a big TV, a dresser, and some bookshelves with some Russian blue colored, like cat, the cat lights, and then there is a balcony out here with lights all around it. You can see in, there is no door to get in that room, but that is where my office used to be until I moved it down like we just saw. And then over here, the last room, until I show you the backyard, is the bathroom. So there's the toilet over there and the shower there. There's some counters, some towels, a tooth toothbrush holder, a hanging up towel, a sink, and the bathroom rule sign that says wash your hands, brush your teeth, flush, floss, hang up your towel, replace empty toilet paper, please put the seat down, turn off the lights. Um, okay, so now I can show you the backyard super quick. Yeah, and I know this house isn't the best, you guys, but it's it's good for me, so yeah. Uh, it's really dark outside, so you can't really see, but there is a gray fence. It's basically the same color as the house, which is a s nice gray. And you can see here there's a playset, so you can climb up, and then you can climb down, and then you can also climb up on this side. Um, it's easier, I think. And then you can actually use these swings. What is it saying to use? The slide? I don't know, the swings. It's just a different way. And the slide, if you can actually walk up it, there is the slide. So then I don't have a pool, actually, because they were pretty expensive. I know I have a lot of money, but I don't want to spend 17000 on a decent-sized pool. A uh, nice trampoline, the enclosed one. I can probably jump over it. Yeah, I can. It is so dark out that I can't see anything, but there's some planter beds and some trees. And then my nice little office window. And I think I might add something here. Well, that is a stairwell. But I was thinking of doing something like in this area so that it's not just this weird gap. Um, yeah, so that is my house. Um... I know, like I said before, it's not the best at all, but it is good for me at least, and I enjoy having it. So if you don't, well, too bad, because all that matters is that I like it. And that concludes the video. I know that one was pretty short again, but I like the last Scoob one, but I just wanted to t show you more on my new house. And yes, Scoob Part 2 will be coming very soon. I just wanted to do this video and get back on my Blocksburg track. Before I got back into Adopt Me, I will be doing some like Royal High videos at some point. This is not just a Bloxburg channel, but yes, I know the majority of my videos will be Bloxburg. Okay, guys, please subscribe to the Kitty Corner. I would really, really appreciate it. And go check out It's Aquila's channel. Well, It's Aquila. And 
I know it's weird that I'm supporting another YouTuber, but I love her so much. She's such an inspiration, and a lot of my house is actually inspired off of her. So, no, I didn't just copy her. I just inspired it off of her. Anyway, please give a big thumbs up on this video, and once you subscribe, turn on the notification bell so you get notified anytime I upload or post a new video. And comment down below your favorite part of the house. My favorite part of the house is probably the little nook in here. Or the office part. I'm Not the office. This little part I was just sitting in. Anyway, guys, that concludes the video once and for all. And I hope you have a perfect rest of your day.